Tickets to the senior class play cost $2 for students, $5 for adults, and $4 for senior citizens. At Friday night's performance, there were 120 students, 150 adults, and 40 senior citizens in attendance. At Saturday night's performance, there were 192 students, 215 adults, and 54 senior citizens in attendance. Organize the information using matrices, then use matrix multiplication to find the income from ticket sales for Friday and Saturday night's performances. To organize this information using matrices, notice that we've got two nights um, that our performance was showing, and we've got three types of people attending. So I will do, uh, we've got Friday and Saturday. We'll use those for our rows. And for our columns, we've got our students, uh, adults, and senior citizens. So uh, <clears throat> for Friday, we've got our, our numbers here, 120 students, 150 adults and 40 senior citizens. And for Saturday, we've got 192 students, 215 adults, and 54 seniors. Okay. This can be thought of as a type of inventory matrix, um, right? In, in each of our days, this is how many of each type of person we had. Then we've got our cost uh, matrix. Um, and this is a cost per individual uh, matrix, cost per individual. Okay, we've got, uh, our th again, our three types of individuals. We've got students, adults, and seniors. So the cost for a student is $2, for adults was $5, for senior citizens was $4. So there's our organization into matrices, and then we can use matrix multiplication to find the income uh, from ticket sales. So uh, because the columns match the rows here, we can multiply these. So 120, 150, and 40, 192, 215, and 54 times 2, 3, So this is going this is a uh, this is a 2 by 3 matrix and this is a 3 by 1 matrix. So we're going to end up with a because those are matching, we'll end up with a 2 by 1 matrix. Okay? So and this is going to be of course our Friday Friday and our Saturday. And this will be the cost or in other words the income um, for those two nights. Okay, so for this first entry uh, for, the, for Friday, we're going to go ahead and take our first row and multiply by that column. So that's 120 times 2 plus 150 times 3 plus 40 times 4. And for our second entry, that's our second row and first column. We have 192 times 2 plus 215 times 3 plus 54 times 4. Plugging these into a calculator uh, gives us 850 for the first one and that 1,245 for the second one. Um, I guess I probably should have used the same color up here. Okay, so there's our our cost or income matrix uh, that tells us how much was how much revenue they had each of those nights.